We've seen the crowd come and go. The families have grown up, brought the kids here. And of course, we've done some of that ourselves. We've had some sad times, we've had some happy times, but they've all been good times. You see, it's just like any family. And somehow the family sticks together through it all. You know, we've been very fortunate to be in a business that is family related, you know, and that's happened for so many generations that I don't even think about it as something different. Uh, you know, you, Jake, Max, you know, Tommy, all the kids, all the generations, I've seen them just roll through here. So seeing another generation, to me, it, the one thing I do know, they go right, boom, it's like you blink your eye and they're up and running and next thing you know, they're in junior high getting ready to go to college. <laughs> so I started, I was brought in by my father at 16. And uh, since I have my own child, boy, they're now old enough to join the speed school, uh, they come in twice a week. I come in two to three times a week, definitely with them, bring them, and it's kept me more consistent. I think one of the most important things about having the Preezy Seed School is to continue this idea that our grandfather started, which is um, to nurture this community. And we have kids in here all the time training, and they can train with their families. We have clients that can bring us their kids. We have clients that can bring us their grandmothers. We have clients that can bring us their mothers. and. We can train all of them. We can help better their lives and make it a family atmosphere all the time. I've been a Waring's gym member since the mid 80s when I was back in high school and uh, had a lot of great memories and experiences with John Waring, the founder and his sons and now his grandsons. My wife and our son uh, now work out here regularly and uh, it's kind of a family tradition. I, uh, I, I grew up here and I'm, I'm very proud that my son's getting to do the same thing. And I actually get to spend time with Tom. He's so busy all the time, so actually in the afternoons when we can work out together, it's actually kind of a nice surprise and a nice moment for us to have during the day. And like you said, our son is working out here now too, and the confidence that he has gotten from the whole Wearings team is unmeasurable, and we really can't thank the Wearings team enough. I love just coming here with Josh, especially because it's a way that we bond and we get to enjoy each other just us time and I know that he is just a few feet away in the nursery and he's getting lots of loving from Sarah and the other babies and the other kids like he loves just hanging out and watching that and so he's getting great socialization and playtime as well as we are. It's important to get him exposed to that at a very early age and this gym gives us an opportunity to do that. Yes. Both my kids were literally born here. <laughs> I was coming until I was like eight, nine months pregnant and all. So they've been at the daycare since they were like two months old. And that's all they know. So it's, I have gained a lot of good friendships at Wearings and I've met people professionally and they will be friends for a lifetime. A lot of the group exercises that I have taken at Wearings for years before these guys were even here, there was a lot of team building with them. A lot of girls that I end up getting good relationships with. They were very competitive classes and every time you take the class, you know, your heart is beaten out of your chest. But then after you finished, everybody's like cheering each other on and, you know, after that we were going for drinks together, going to beach together and, you know, raising kids together and meeting up and it's just been a good village for me. It's really special when you come into the gym and obviously Deb and I, my wife and I come in quite a bit, but when we see our children and now we're even to the next level with grandchildren and uh, I, frankly I probably see them here more than I do any place across the city. My sister was the original uh, member of the family to join wearing gym. And I don't remember how long ago it was, but it's got to be 40 or 50 years ago. See, I went to the school with Mike Waring, and we're the same age, and obviously I knew his father and, and things, but, you know, it, it all just goes full circle to, to have my family here and also to be working out with friends that I've grown up with all these years. <laughs>